Hey guys, G5 Cosmos here once again for Game 5 Smash today with another unboxing video. A very special one. I've just received this in the mail, and uh, what I'm going to be unboxing is a very, very rare Starlight Gold GameCube controller. This is an official uh, Nintendo GameCube controller in a very rare color. Um, as a disclaimer, uh, you might be wondering, you know, you see this box. Actually, this box doesn't really give it away. This is a used controller that I'm unboxing. Uh, and you might be wondering, why am I unboxing something that's used? Well, the reason is uh, this controller is only available, or I should say it was only available, bundled with a GameCube uh, console of the same color. And for that reason, you cannot get the controller new ever. So there's really no way to unbox just the controller in a new condition. That being said, um, Based on the pictures that I saw, this controller is in very good condition and it's going to look really nice. And this is my first time opening the box that it's in anyway. So let's get right to it. That's definitely this box is been around a while. Okay. Alrighty then. Very nice packing. Okay. And here we have it. And I think that everything else is just packaging, so I'm going to put the box aside. Wow, that is in excellent condition. And there it is, guys. Starlight Gold Nintendo GameCube controller. Barely even feels like it's been played on. Um, the only thing which, as I saw on the original pictures too, this tiny specs, which is uh, very common areas to get, you know, any kind of damage uh, on this kind of paint job. So a little background uh, on the controller in general as well as the, I'll start with talking about the paint. Um, let me bring this right up to the camera also so you can get a really nice look at that. Um, most GameCube controllers like the Indigos, the, 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 the blacks and the whites, um, you know, the typical controllers that we're all familiar with, uh, they have, it's just uh, colored plastic. So they just, you know, mold the plastic into the color, uh, in the color that you see it in, and that's what you get. But uh, a few controllers, uh, as far the only ones I can think of actually are, are this guy right here, the Starlight Gold, and the Platinum, of course, which is much more common. Uh, it's actually painted plastic, so it's like regular just plain gray plastic uh, underneath this, but then they use like a metallic paint uh, on top of it and that's what makes it so prone to scratching so it's really hard to find one of these in such great condition uh, as you see here just like barely a speck on it and it just glows it's just beautiful um, so a little more background on the controller itself uh, this was released in Japan only uh, as a Toys R Us exclusive the console it was a GameCube co uh, console in the same color Starlight Gold and uh, only available in Japan, only limited time as a Toys R Us exclusive. And that was the only way to, the, literally the only way to have got this controller originally, uh, you know, from Nintendo was to get that console. And uh, you would get this controller with it, of course, as well as the console itself. You can, you can uh, buy the consoles online 
too, uh, used, of course. But uh, I don't think they're as rare as the controller for some reason. Well, that doesn't make any sense that you would buy them together. But I don't know. I've seen the consoles for cheaper than I've seen the controller. And it also may be a condition thing. Like uh, the console is not as going to be moved around as much. It's not as prone to, you know, scratching, I guess. But um, yeah, that's going to about do it for this video. I have one more um, GameCube controller. Uh, unboxing that I do have planned whenever I get that. So again, I hope you guys do enjoy this kind of video, but uh, this week we're also going to be having another tech video. Uh, I have a couple planned. I'm not sure exactly which one is going to be featured this week, but you can stay tuned to this channel if you want to check that out. And let me know what you, again, what you guys think uh, of this format of video. You can let me know in the comments. And yeah, thank you guys for watching. Always feel free to like, share, and subscribe. It really helps out uh, the channel. If you do any of those things, if you want to support, that will help. Either way, thank you for watching.